and the light is on again. Hello YouTube, SK here, I'm back with another video. Uh, first of all I'd like to start off by apologising to you guys for the ridiculous time span between the previous video and this one that's going to be published as soon as I'm done. I'm really sorry for that, we had a lot of stuff going on, me and Elsie, so we haven't been able to make any videos and publish them. A uh, lot of stuff with uh, jobs now because me and Elsie both now have jobs we of course are going to, so it brings up a few time issues, but we are working around them now and I can finally put a video out for you guys now that I've got the time to. Uh, the light is out again because I'm filming late-ish, so if I took the light off it's a lot more darker than the light on. So <laughs> I'm going to keep this on. Um, the purpose, I've got a little bit of a subject to this vlog, uh, it's just a sort of a chilled out one, but um, in a recent video by a YouTuber who's also a friend of mine and LC's, uh, Amy or Amstrex has posted a zombie apocalypse tag and in that she mentioned about myself being into Assassin's Creed and stuff and that gave me the idea for my latest vlog, you know this this is what gave me a subject for it so again thank you actually uh, for that so I'm gonna go through a couple of things, I'm gonna tell you guys a couple of things that I like about Assassin's Creed and a few things that I've got as well as I can show you a few things that I have with me today um, so like LC, I am absolutely obsessed with Assassin's Creed. I have played every single game, the main ones, to be honest. I have a, there's one I've missed, Assassin's Creed Rogue. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the biggest fan of that game because it's really nothing to do with the assassins. Really, you're playing as a Templar or someone who's not an assassin, so I don't understand what the purpose of the video, or sorry, the game is. So, yeah. Um, I absolutely love the Assassin's Creed trilogy and the series, and I hope they continue. I'm looking forward to Syndicate, the new Assassin's Creed Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Uh, it looks really good. I'm just a couple. Of, I've still got some worries about it, to be totally honest. You know, they seem to still have the same sort of running animation, and some things look kind of similar. Um, but no, I'm actually I'm really looking forward to it, and it's going to be really cool. And I hope to pre-order it and such. Um, I'll talk about some things I've got then. I haven't got some things. Some of the stuff I've got with me, some things I don't, because I've either lost it or I just don't have it anymore. Um, so with some small things. I used to have a Assassin's Creed dog tag. I had a uh, Assassin's Creed three dog tag. It was just the Assassin's Creed symbol with the three dashes in the middle. Um, I also had a Assassin's Creed three T-shirt. It had a picture of Connor uh, with his tomahawk at. It's about to strike down a British. I think it was a British soldier. So kind of like in the uh, like in the trailer, the very first trailer they release. Um, I think that's best I could think of from what I haven't got with me. So I'll just go with the two things I've got with me. Uh, I'll go with the sort sort of the less well, I guess less awesome one. Uh, I have this with me, which is a. It's really hard to see because it's all crumpled up, but it's really a. It's an Assassin's Creed coat. It's like a. Um, it's like a cosplay coat, I think, something along those lines. Um, but it's made out of leather. And it's based on Connor's really. It's white and blue, uh, and it has the it has really cool sleeves and buckles, and it has the long tassels at the back that hang off. It is very fiddly. It's a very fiddly uh, jacket thing, and it is very big actually. It's a very big jacket, but that was really cool. Got that from uh, I think it was Amazon or eBay, one of them. Um, it's quite a lot of money actually. It's about seventy pound, something along those lines. Um, but uh, I bought it for my birthday. It's it's a really cool looking jacket, and I was just obsessed with it. When I saw it, I thought, "Oh my god, there's something that's really like it." <laughs> um, second one is my is my favorite piece of Assassin's Creed merchandise, I guess. Um, it is this, the Assassin's Creed Four or Black Flag. Uh, this is the pirate hidden blade and gauntlet, basically um, Edward's uh, hidden blade. Now uh, it is really cool. I have worn it a few times, just around. Um, that is the blade. It is all plastic. All of it is plastic, except for like probably a metal spring, and that's probably anything from metal on the screws. Uh, it is really, really cool. It's like it straps on, just like with these Velcro, and it's really, really awesome. Uh, it has a safety, uh, or like a safety slash on and off switch on the back. So if it's 
I'm holding this wrong at the camera. <laughs> if you have it that side, so my left, your right, um, maybe, uh, it'll be off, and then you flick it to the other side, then you can use it. You press the skull, out comes the blade. Now, the only issue I've got with this thing is it's a bit wobbly. I'm not going to say what I'm thinking now about how wrong that looks, but. Oh, I'm going to say that looks like either. But, um, yeah, it's a bit wobbly, but other than that, it's actually a quite sturdy, nice piece. It comes with the, um, the gauntlet, but it's this, it's this big ass piece here. It looks like leather, but it's actually plastic. It is plastic. Kind of regrettably. I wish it was real leather. Um, but that is a, it's, a, it's not bad. It's, it's sort of shapeable. You can sort of shape it to fit your size of arm. And such and it, it look it does look really nice. It's been very well made and textured to look like genuine leather, which is cool. Um, so there's something else. Oh, it's been really bold. But it, it does come with this. Um, sure, have anyway. Includes a skull buckle. So that there. It comes with that, and if you can see by the by the picture, it has like a uh, a second strap here. That goes round the wrist. You know, it, I guess it can go round the wrist. I don't know where you really want to put it, but I assume that the the skull buckle attaches to that. The this this uh, extra waist thing, or it's a genuine like a belt buckle or something like that. Either way, it is really cool. Uh, I will do sort of like a, a nice review of that thing, or just a show off of me wearing it, maybe later in this video, or perhaps in a separate video. You know. Um, so yeah, that's some Assassin's Creed stuff, and um, uh, that is another vlog now that I finally got for you guys. Uh, another good bit of information is I finally verified my YouTube account, so apparently I'm not a robot. Hello. Mm. Uh, and so that uh, that asked me to do a few more things, so the video is going to be looking a bit more, I'm hoping to make the appearance of the videos look a bit better, and the videos themselves a bit better, because I, I can now record and publish uh, longer videos, like very long videos. I can I can do 50 minutes plus now. My 50 minutes would be my maximum if I hadn't verified. Such a simple thing, anyway. I didn't bother doing it, but now I have. So I've done that, uh, and I can I can make some thumbnails for my own videos now. So I have, to, I have to keep seeing a picture of me on the front of each thumbnail. That's, if that makes the thumbnail, I will be really happy. <laughs> but I actually can now. Actually, that's a good idea. But um. Yeah, I've been rambling on enough. I'll have some more videos for you in the future. I do have some airsoft stuff now that I can finally put on a video for you guys, as well as I'm going to be making a few more vlogs. I'm going to record maybe three videos right now. This will be the first of possibly three, uh, and I'll get them published tonight. And I shall, um, and me and I'll see, we'll have some more videos for you tomorrow because we are doing videos tomorrow as well, mostly more than one. So look forward to that as well if you are. Um, and thank you again. We've almost seen 40 subscribers, which is weirdly close to the 50 mark. 50 subscribers is when we're going to start celebrating another with another video, a better one. But I'm really surprised at how many people have started to subscribe now, even though it's really not that much. But so again, a quick thank you for that. And we have almost hit 1,000 views in total on the channel, uh, which I'm very happy about. So again, thank you guys for supporting me and LC and getting the channel the views that we want. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you are new to watching these videos, uh, please check out the vlogs on the channel and Elsie's art video and look forward to some new videos in the future. Um, if you don't know, we do gaming, we do all kinds of videos. Uh, like the video if you did. Uh, comment on anything you'd like to see, anything you enjoy, you didn't. Feedback and such is a-okay because it n lets me know what I'm doing right and wrong and what you guys want to see better. Um, so yeah. And again, the last thing of all, if you really like the videos and you want to see more, please, please subscribe to the channel. It'd be awesome if you did. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. I've said that many times now in this video, I think. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys in another video or whatever video comes up next, vlog or not. Cheers, everyone. Bounce.
waiting for the 10 minute mark to stop this video. Yes! 